so my name is Julie Mortensen and I farm here with my husband and some of our family. Our farm is called uh, Mortensen Farms LTD. We run a mixed operation, so about 5,000 acres of grain land and uh, a few hundred head of cattle. We run both commercial cow-calf herd as well as a purebred seed stock hold Hereford business. My husband's parents actually bought this farm back in 1988 and they started with 25 cows and just a half section of land and we've grown to the size we are today through being um, as sustainable and environmentally friendly as we can be while uh, improving our quality and quantity of uh, production, be that oil seeds, um, grains or uh, cattle. This past fall, I decided to start the program Classroom Cattle. It's a program which uh, I hope connects youth in Canada to agriculture production, specifically beef. Basically, I use my ranch to connect with students across Canada and I've let them virtually adopt a calf on our farm. And throughout the course of the school year, they follow the growth and different stages of that calf and learn a little bit about our production practices. So we talk about things like vaccinations, um, how that calf is growing, what they eat, how we take care of them, what we do with them day to day. And then they also learn a little bit about the other side of the business. So where that calf is going to when they leave our farm and uh, the different uses for it, whether that is breeding stock or meat production. Uh, so I've had really great feedback so far on my classroom cattle program. It's been great to give back and give them something to be excited about for this year. Kids really connect with animals and so it's great to see them initially form that connection with the animal and then as we start building on the program become more involved with talking about the beef production and uh, what that animal's purpose in life is for. So I think as farmers and ranchers, we are a bit nervous to connect with the, most of the public just because we do feel the great divide between us and we want to make sure we bridge that gap and I think the government is helping us do that by offering things such as the Agriculture Awareness, Awareness Initiative Program and my Classroom Cattle pro Program has been lucky enough to gain some funding through that. But I think it's great that they're offering it because it really helps to offset some of the costs uh, for me of doing the program and really encourages me to keep going, showing that there is support out there to try and bridge the gap between um, producer and consumer.